Hi, this is a tutorial video on creating a cartoon effect in your photos with using the program GIMP. Uh, I've got GIMP open right now. We'll just go ahead and get started. I'm going to go to File, Open a Photo. And the photo I've decided to use is a photo of my daughter when she was a few months younger than she is right now. Now, to create a cartoon effect on this photo, the first thing I want to do is go to Layer. And you're going to come down from Layer to Duplicate Layer. Click that, and you'll notice another layer shows up on the right-hand side here in your uh, Layer and Brushes window. And then I'm going to go to Filters. And I'm going to choose the Artistic Filter Cartoon. I'm going to open that up and it brings up a preview window. I'm going to make this a little bit bigger so we can kind of see what we're talking about here. And I'm going to go to a part of the photo that um, I'm going to be able to tell some of the changes that are going on. I'm going to use part of her eye and a little bit of her nose there. Okay, now when you're adjusting this you have mask radius and you have percent black. Uh, I would say you probably want to go all the way up on mask radius to 50. If you look, if I go to just a little bit up on mask radius, you can see there's a lot of spots here where there's nothing going on. And let's go a little this way. It's pretty, it looks grainy almost. The more I turn it up, the less grainy it is in this sort of area here. I'm not talking about the lines that are supposed to be dark around her eyes, outlining the eyes. I'm talking about these open areas here that really don't have a whole lot going on there. They've got too much grainy areas. And as it go up, you can kind of see it's not as grainy. You can see that the lines surrounding her eyes and uh, nose, they are a bit darker. And that's what we want. So I've got it all the way up to 50. Looks pretty good. Now this is the part where you're going to kind of play with it for your preference and it depends on the photo as well. So um, sometimes I'll use like around 0 0.3 something but in this particular photo um, if I go down to about let's say 2 maybe 0 0.20 I kind of like how that looks. This is the percent of black that's in a uh, given area. Okay, so I'm happy with what I've got. Let's hit OK and let's see how it looks on the entire photo. Now, you'll notice down on the bottom it's scrolling over as it renders it. It's going to show us how our changes have affected this entire photo. Now, don't worry, um, unless you hit save, you're not changing your original photo yet. Right now we're just seeing what could what it could look like if we decide to save it. Very good. I like how this looks. It looks um, uh, like it was drawn. And we could stop here. We could say, okay, we've color, uh, we've cartooned this photo uh, to where we're happy. And we could leave it at that. And I might do that. And when you do that, you might want to go to save as so that you can save your original copy and you don't affect it. Um, if you want to see what the original looks like and go back between uh, the changes we've made and just just to view it, we're not going to get rid of the changes. You go over here to layers and you see the little eyeball here. That means if you can see it or not. And I'm going to click this top one and it takes away our the viewing those changes. You could see how it looked before and how it looks after. So I'm happy with this. Uh, we've cartooned it. Now we can take it a step further. Let's say you wanted to make this look like a charcoal painting. Well, typically charcoal paintings aren't going to have color in it. So we're going to want to take that color out. And that's all we want to do to make this look like a charcoal painting. We can just go to Colors, Colorfy, and it'll show us a preview there. But we'll just hit OK to have it rendered in the photo that we have in front of us here and it looks pretty good. It looks like a charcoal painting. So I'm going to keep that. So now what we've done is 
uh, let's go back over what we did. We opened a photo, we went to layer, went to duplicate layer, then we went to filters, we chose the artistic filter cartoon. When that opened up, we chose our um, settings here, and then we were done. And then we decided to take a step further and make it into like a charcoal painting. And we took the colors out by going to colors, colorify, and then OK. So there's the video. If you have any questions, uh, put them in the comment section. I'll try my best to answer them. And um, in future videos, we'll be doing some more uh, filters, uh, more effects. And we'll also go over some uh, graphics that you can make. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.